All right, we are back on the road again. My truck was down, so I wasn't able to make very many videos here at work. It was on uh, last Friday. My truck was having the same electrical issues again, where it didn't care where you were going or how fast you were going, it would just shut off. So I was having problems with that. I'd been having problems with it for two or three weeks, but usually underneath the hood in that fuse box, I could take out a couple of relays and jiggle the wires around, jam the relays back down in there and it would start back up. But you can only wiggle wires so many times before they either break or pull away and they're no longer connected to anything. So it ended up in the shop. The guy said, yeah, I should, I should be able to take it Friday and have it back by Monday. Well, that didn't happen because today's Friday and I just got it back. But it's up and running again, so we're back on the road. And while the truck was down, I was helping out in the yard, which means I took a big dip in hours. Because at the yard, I was pretty much limited to 11 hours a day. So you show up at 6 and we get kicked out at 5. So not having the truck definitely affected my paycheck. But now that we're back on the road, I can go out and do more stuff and get more hours. Continue to have my uh, my good hour days. And then I uh, should be able to get back to work in Saturdays because I have to, kept asking the boss if we were working Saturdays. And he's a lying dickhead. He told me three weeks in a row, I asked him, hey, we working Saturday? He said, no, no, we're way too slow. Come to find out Monday, he came in Saturday and called a couple other select people that, you know, he likes more. So I'm just going to start showing up. Screw him. I'm just going to start showing up. Deal with it later. If he tells me, no, we're not working, and he's just lying straight to my face, then he's personally responsible for taking taking money out of my family's pocket and I can't afford that so we should be able to get back to working Saturdays uh, having that bug out bag with me it's kind of my everyday carry now wherever I am that bag happens to be there too I'll throw it in whatever truck I'm in or have it nearby whenever I'm working somewhere came in handy having that because Kansas weather in the past two weeks has fluctuated probably 60 degrees see early last week to late last you know later last week it started out the days in the 30s but then by this monday this past monday it was 90 92 degrees and then back here towards the end of the week again it started out today in the lower 40s so having that bag around has really been helping because I had the extra cold weather gear in there that I've been using. Plus with the extra water and stuff I keep in there, I always had extra water around because normally in my truck, I keep that cooler in the passenger seat. So I've got um, seven or eight Gatorade bottles in there full of water and then some you know, 12 pack of Mountain Dew. Well, not having that cooler around, I always had to have a bottle with me, so I had that extra water in that uh, in that bug out bag so that came in handy uh, I haven't put anything else in it yet I'm still waiting on some packages to come in and ordered them off eBay and they're coming from China so it said that since it was ordered on it was like October 15th it said the delivery date was somewhere between October 20 October 20th you know somewhere between October 20th and December 20th December 1st so there really is it's just one of those things you order the stuff and then you just kind of have to forget about it and wait and then once it comes in you go oh hey look I got a gift <laughs> so I'm still waiting on those I got some more items coming to test out see if they work and throw in there but it's kind of nice to have the truck back and it's Friday got some stuff to do this weekend because everything gets pushed off to the weekend when you work a bunch of hours. Every every other business out there opens after you know, after I get to work and they close before I get off. So 
everything gets pushed off onto the weekends. So, yep, back to making videos in the truck again. So we'll see y'all in the next one. I'm gonna keep on working. Y'all keep on working. Bye.